Hello, and welcome to Marcus. Welcome to Marcus. Hello. I didn't see you come in. Today we're going to talk about animal cruelty to the extreme. We are going to meet a few people who have committed this amazing, amazing crime against humanity and against everything. All creatures, great and small, some people rape animals, some people kill animals, some people eat animals. And they do it like this. <laughs> That's your average funnel back snake down in Sheffield. Poor glider, it's dead now. Just strangled it with its oxygen. What can it do? Hello, and welcome to the show. Today we'll be talking about um, animal molestation. Uh, we'll be talking to a few people, uh, well, two people today. Uh, one is for animal molestation, or death, and one is against all that uh, cruelty and badness happening to God's gate great creatures. Let's see what happens to today. <laughs> right, this is the, uh, the, these are the two dimwit, uh, two dimwit arseholes we have in today, really. Um, he's for animal death, and he's against... No! It's the wrong, you put it the wrong way around. I haven't... Stopped. I am against animal death thoroughly all my life. I've never supported... I'm sorry, but yeah. that's, that's a lie. You've hunted many, many animals. You, you've actually hunted uh, foxes to extinction. There are no foxes left. Well, and you are uh, called the saviour of animals. <laughs> And I think that's a very, no, a very no, noble thing. Seriously, you got have, I got, have I got it confused? Is it the other wrong way? way Is it the other way? Yeah, absolutely. So you're informing dramatically. You're informing the twats. You got it the wrong way. Well, well, I think I just did. They're, they're not twats. Don't worry, um, we'll beat that shit. I made my sense of this. Um, right, you are an animal hater. Is that not right? <laughs> no. You hate animals. Well, I suppose I do. But yeah. No, no, don't. You love animals. I'm the animal hater. Really? Yeah, I have done. Well, no one likes animals, animals who this. Well, don't say Excuse like... me, who, who is the, who's the animal hater and lover? You can see in the text underneath. I, I need to know that before me we start filming. Uh, uh, Matt is the animal hater. Um, I am the animal lover. Okay, I'm right. against animals. Okay, okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm okay, so, you're right, you're for the animals. That's brilliant, that's a noble cause. You're a bastard. That's what I mean. You're, you, are, you, sir, you, sir, are, you're completely out of order. That's prejudice. You're out of order. Why do you hate animals? Why do you hate animals? Well, a lot of experiences in my life have, a lot of the bad experiences have come about because an animal was pissed. Is that not wrong? Pissed a family. Is that not wrong? It's always been an animal. Right? You, you're wrong. You are very, very, very wrong. Animals my grandmother was contribute to the world's oxygen. Your grandmother was My grandmother was only 76 before a dog took her life. She was that, was her pet. that was her pet, that was Sparky, and he was a terrier. Did, um, did, did your grandmother aggro did your grandmother aggravate that, that bull terrier? Yes. Yeah, put him in a net and then sort of shook him about with it. But well, she was only seven. It was self defense. She might have been 76, she was still an animal. Right, okay. Right, let's just break up a little. Right, okay. Just move That's back. Nice. Move back. So, I mean, what do you think of this man here? I mean, how does he does he really aggravate you? Look at him. Look at him. Look. You you look into his eyes and you you see that you see those animals dying. You right. see the rabbits out of Woodship Down getting crushed, and it's not acceptable. To be honest, and he is a bad man. I see. Not being biased, he's evil. I see and a man loved by his friends, loved by his family. Thank you. Loved by his contemporaries. What um, about everybody else, Charlie? Everybody else. What about everybody else? They think he's a prick. That means a exactly. Lot. Exactly um, right. The first he bit. thinks the animals. The first bit look, meant, meant the, a lot. The other people don't matter. It's everybody else. They're the ones who matter, and in your, in their eyes, you're a scumbag, and you have done nothing to deserve a good reputation. You, on the other hand, you're an animal supporter, and you, you do, you know, you're charitable. You do a lot for the, for the environment, a lot for the community. I've done a lot for the environment. How? Killing I'm... foxes, shooting yes. little pheasants, shooting defenseless eggs. You buy eggs from supermarkets and this guy pierce them with this. Safety pins. This man does not wash his milk bottles. 
he keeps them for himself. Like, the milkman, where do you think the milkman gets now, the bottles Now you're, you're sort of going off the issue. You're no, going, I'm just saying in milk the, bottles, the environment. Milk bottles are a different issue. It does no good. And he is a saviour to the animals. This no, is, no, this he, is, he, he, he's this speaking is, out of turn. Marcus, This is Dr. Doolittle. I know this is your that. show, but you're speaking out of turn. You're, you're speaking, speaking in, way, you're talking to me way above your station. Deserve, yeah. this, this is Dr. Doolittle you're doing here. And you, you, sir, it's, no, you shouldn't do that. I'm allowed. Bodyguard, I'm backstage. A, I'm a suspect. Right. I think that you should probably rethink your life pattern. Just rethink when you're going. What are you gonna You're trying first? to imply that I've only told about my life once. All you, all you do is commit torture to animals. Dickhead talk. Uh, well, no, it's not dickhead talk. I, I don't before. appreciate I've that. I don't appreciate that one all bit. All my mates. All, all my you, mates. Just what exactly makes of these? The what makes of these? You are. What mates? And basically, I've told them. Well, they're That's good mates. Told them. Exactly. They're good mates. If they want you to stop, uh, stop hindering animals, stop hurting them, them, they're good mates. They're the role models. Follow they can't be on my logic. side. They can't be on my side. Oh, I'm sorry about this. Oh. I'm sorry. I'm sorry about this. Right. Um, it's everybody, everyone's got a bit of violent here. Um, you can see this person here. He has got quite a serious issue. This is not a subtle person you want to see out on the street harming animals. This person has serious, serious problems. And he needs to fix it up right now. What do you say, audience? What do you say? Of course, so. Throw your life out. You're a disgrace. You should be like him. He's the person who cares for animals. <laughs> you like and me. you, you're a fucking travesty. You should. You've not heard the last of me. He's got me there. Oi. Okay, I suppose we've had a, a long day here today and we've uh, heard many people's sort of opinions on, on the matter of animal cruelty. Um, but now we'll go over to today's uh, final thought and I think that you should reflect on that for the rest of your lives. Charlie. Oh, I don't like packies, I don't like niggers, I don't like racists. I think you should think about that. It's a bit off the point of animals. <laughs> I suppose we've, uh, today we've heard lots of people's opinions, lots of people's expressions on animal cruelty and you know it goes without saying that you know people who do commit animal cruelty are evil people, they are basically an incarnation of Satan. Um, but now, right now, we're going to um, hand you over to uh, Charlie, um, our, good, our, good, uh, our good sport of the day, and he'll give you a life lesson, a final thought on animal cruelty. Let's see, uh, let's see what he says. Like cats and dogs. Cats or dogs are cool. That zounts. And snakes. Um, Both are bastards. They're, they're venomous and they're not a, they're not the best animal ever. And <laughs> snakes, they do kill. Um, I'll probably go more for piglets. Yeah, piglets are nice. I'm a big fan of piglets. Just, I mean, like frogs are cool as well. I think frogs are generally sort of a bit defenceless, apart from if they're poisonous as well. Like snakes. And... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Very, very true. Yeah, I like a pig off really place for piglet FC. I'll tell you what, cute animals. Foxes. Foxes aren't without a charm. Baby foxes. And vixens are the you would animal if you're a male fox. <laughs> <laughs> On the ground, they <laughs> That's a rabbit. <laughs> Thank you for watching and goodbye.